In this video, we are going to learn about the language of chemistry. This is the fifth lesson of the 8th standard ICAC code. We are going to recall the symbols of different elements and uh, we can derive the formula of compounds on the basis of valencies of elements and radicals. And then we can write chemical equations of a reaction. Then the balance chemical equations by applying the law of conservation of mass. Of elements. A symbol represents the shortest form of an element. Next one qualitative and a quantitative meaning of the term symbol. Do you know what is qualitative meaning? A symbol represents the specific term. For example, yes represents the element of sulfur. The Symbol represents one atom of an element. That is, in this case, S yes represents one atom of sulfur. Here we took the example for sulfur. Sulfur's symbol is S yes and it represents one atom of an element. Next, quantitative meaning. A symbol represents the mass of an element equal to its atomic mass. For example, S yes represents how many times it is heavier than atomic mass unit. Here the atomic mass unit is uh, the shortest form is AMU which is defined as 1 by 12th mass of carbon atom. In the present case, sulfur atom is 32 times heavier than 1 AMU. AMU means atomic mass unit. Hence the atomic mass of the sulfur is 32. Do you know what is chemical formula? The chemical formula of a substance that is the element or compound is the symbolic representation of actual number of atoms present in one molecule of the substance. An element is termed as monatomic if it has only one atom, that is single atom. In such a situation, its molecular formula is the symbol of the element. For example, sodium and magnesium. Sodium symbol is Na and magnesium symbol is Mg. Here, the molecular formula of the sodium and magnesium also same as the symbol of sodium and magnesium. When an element exists as a molecule which consists of two or more atoms, then its molecular formula is the symbol of element with the subscript on the right hand side that represents the atoms, number of atoms present in one molecule. For example, the molecule of phosphorus has four atoms, hence its molecular formula is P subscript 4. A molecule of compound can have the number of atoms of different elements present in whole number. The molecular formula of the compound is written by writing the number of atoms of each element in its one molecule. For example, for a glucose, the molecular formula is C6H12O6. It represents that one molecule of glucose has 6 atom, atoms of carbon, 12 atoms of hydrogen and 6 atoms of oxygen. 